Well, hello there, all you beautiful people. Dre here, and welcome back to another episode of Dealer Simulator. Today is an exciting one because the auction house is out. Got a little bit of bad news, though. We need to actually own a store to do it. So it's like an elitist auction house. So we didn't buy that in the last episode. We got to get lucky today and sell a bunch of stuff. I very much like to see it like that. We got a 490 here. Unfortunately, it is broken. Uh, is it actually in there, though? There's definitely a 490 in there. So hopefully I don't give this one away for free. And we get to use our new vehicle so I can just throw things in here and I don't have to worry about them going everywhere. Uh, just being able to see the price is so nice. So yeah, obviously the goal right now, we got to sell a bunch of stuff because I need about $20,000 to buy the first uh, store. I didn't realize the one downside of this van is I have a roof I have to worry about. <laughs> you know what? I seriously don't think this van is better than the truck now that I'm using it. <laughs> Maybe it's just this thing because it's so freaking big, but I can't even get it in there. All right, I'm just going to leave that out. It's only worth $100 anyways. I can always grab it later. All right, now all we got is a skateboard and some boxes. Now, I'm super excited. With this update, there's a bunch of new items you can get too. I think it was like 75 or something like that. And I think that's where this game's going to truly shine is the amount of selection we have with items. So I'm really hoping we can get lucky and find some of those new items in here. <gasps> Ooh, we got uh, 1,200. We got a 7,900. Oh, this is a good start. This is some small items that are big. All right, that one only had a purse in it and some cheap shoes. Hopefully, there's some something decent in the purse. <gasps> oh, I think we got another Rolly. I, I think it's always a green box when there's a Rolex in it. This is this is my best locker. If this is anything to go by, this is going to be fantastic. Uh, let me just make sure. Yep, another $1,000. So that is $3,000 so far. And the final box. Wow. <laughs> Serious luck. I mean, unfortunately, the processor isn't the best one. It's, it's, a, it's only an i3. All right, and that's it. So, yeah, we didn't do too bad with that. Oh, yeah, skateboard. Almost forgot that. And that's an extra $20. Any little bit counts. All right, back to the chair boss. Is it really worth the effort to get this thing in here? Seriously, is this a chair for giants? I can't. It's like, it, it's an... Dude, everywhere, every angle I try, it's not going in. It's not even getting close to sliding in. You know what? I wonder. Good enough. If, if we drop it, I truly don't care. Okay, and it definitely falls off. You know what? I might just go back to the truck until we get the box truck, because if I get big items like that, this thing is a bit faster, but I don't think it's really better, honestly. I'd rather just have a truck without a top on it, so I don't have to worry about that. So yeah, hopefully that chair will be there later. We'll, we'll grab it when we can. I gotta get back and sell some stuff quickly. Oh, this is so cool. So yeah, the big thing is RC cars are in the game now. And I think you could actually drive them. So this is one of the other sellers at the shop. You can kind of see some of the new items. I don't think they actually had stock before. So that's been updated as well. There's just so many items in this game. That makes me so happy. Most of these games, they're so basic. I just, I love this. Ooh, someone wants my 490. How much are you going to pay me, sir? What the hell is that offer? I, I'm not, I'm just going to send away, dude. All right, well, we made it to 1,000. It's getting pretty late, so we might be able to sell a bit more. Uh, what I really want to get right now, we might actually have enough because I've been selling a lot. Wait, where'd my skill? I haven't gained any skill points. Oh, wait, no, I did. I, I was looking at that thinking that was my skill points. Okay, so we got 14. So we're finally going to get more warehouses. I think what I want to do from now on is just buy two at one area. What is going on? I ha I was getting decent offers with this thing, and I sent them away. Now I'm getting these awful offers. I should have accepted. I think I got an offer of 900, so we'll wait. I don't need money right away, at least. But yeah, uh, I need to have time to sell all this stuff. So if I can get two lockers at one place and come here and spend the majority of my day selling, I think that's the smartest idea for right now because I don't want a whole stockpile of junk here. And it is kind of adding up. So yeah, tomorrow we'll buy two more lockers and hopefully we can uh, sell it all in one day. And uh, come on, man. And yeah, well, we need $20,000, so we're going to have to sell a lot and get a few more lucky lockers like we did today. All right, and that's officially it. So yeah, a little over 5000 not too bad. Looking at the items left, we still got that one Rolex that I've been patiently waiting for and the 490 as well. So we still got about three grand here and then a bunch of junk items. So yeah, if we were to sell everything, we're sitting at about eight grand right now. We're almost halfway. This actually wouldn't, might not be too bad if we get a few more lucky lockers. Anyways, I got to go back to bed. Tomorrow, we'll buy two more and do the same thing over again. Okay, my car is still under warranty, so I'm gonna... <laughs> Jesus. 
I think I'm going to say goodbye to the van. I just, it's not worth the investment. And we learned something very valuable in the last episode. You can get 100% of your purchase back if you just resell it. So I'm just going to buy the truck again. It's $800. And honestly, like the size difference, look at it. It's, you can't even tell this. I mean, you maybe get a foot extra. The roof is not worth that foot extra though. So we're going back to the OG. And then hopefully I can sell this for the 5,000. And yeah, it looks like I got about 5,000 back. So at least you can invest in cars in this game and not lose everything. What the hell? I must've been in my car, I guess. Ooh, there's a new road through the middle. The developer must've been watching me <laughs> go through the fields, decided to add a new road there. Makes a lot of sense. You really needed that road. Ooh, what is this new too? There's a whole, is this a motel? What is that gonna be? So exciting when a developer's actively updating a game. Like this game has had so many updates. So yeah, I'm excited to see where this world's gonna go in the near future. But yes, we're here now. We're gonna be able to buy two lockers this time. Honestly, hopefully we don't get too many big items. I just want high ticket technology basically right now. But beggars can't be choosers. I'll take it. anything I can get. What? There was like 20 I could choose from yesterday. All right, well, we'll buy one doctor and one police. A nice mixture here. And the first view. Okay, not much, but overall looks pretty good. Nice $750 guitar. Thank you. Got some chairs. I'm just going to keep any of the big items out in case we need to come back. Uh, yeah, let's do this right. We're just going to put it in there and plop. Nice I3 again. Not a very good item, but hey, it's something. We got some paper. Goodbye, paper. And this is why this truck's so great, man. You can just drop everything in here. There we go. We got another mechanic kit. And a play track four. There we go. That's a decent item. Definitely not as good as our first locker today, but I doubt most will be. That was an amazing locker. Let's see. We got a picture. Yeah, this is actually is pretty crap, honestly. Uh, what's this worth? Okay, so we're about thousand dollars so far. These are new, by the way. We got actual gaming PCs in here now. So that's our first new item, I believe. And maybe the guitar is as well. I don't think I've seen a guitar yet, so that's probably new as well. I want to find the RC cars, though, man. You're supposed to be able to actually drive those, I think. Uh, what do we got this time? Ooh, 650X. Okay, 850. All right. That saved us. That alone. And we got some shoes as well. I'm assuming they're not worth very much. Okay, next locker. And okay, big TV. <gasps> yes, I got one and it's working. Okay, please tell me I can actually do this. I think you can... Isn't there a way to use them? Put away... Oh, I thought you could use them. All right, unfortunately, a big TV. This, is, this, These are the kind of items I hate. Big things that have big repair prices. This is only $300. Is it really worth it when it's that big? I don't know. Uh, more chairs. What is up with the freaking chairs, man? Open this. Don't care what it is. <gasps> yes, I do. What is that? Game cup? Oh, it's only worth $350. Uh, and then I don't know. Uh, did we get the 6750 in that? That was a pretty good one, I think. And inside that one, we got a picture of a pirate ship. Worth $90 and something else. And junk cords. We'll take that. Another PS4. All right. And the final one, uh, we'll throw that in there. And just more Lego kits and some other stuff as well. I'm just going to keep that in there. It's only worth $5. I really just don't want to deal with it. All right. And we'll pick up those chairs and get the hell out of here. All right. Back to uh, selling. Hopefully we can sell everything by the end of today. That would be great. I knew waiting would be nice because we got a wonderful lady here that isn't even here to bargain. Sell it. 1100 Thank God. Speaking of that, I should, pay, I should probably pay my bills. My bills for taxes. And I don't understand why I pay taxes considering I don't live anywhere except at a truck stop. But okay. <laughs> Haven't had that yet, dude. It's just like, can I have it for free? You know what? For $13, I just want the skill tree thing. So have fun, buddy. Enjoy your free item. So yeah, it seems like my sweet spot right now is I can sell pretty much two units per day and have the time in the day to sell those things because I believe it closes pretty soon here. So yeah, we'll just continue doing that as tempting as it is to get a loan. Uh, we're at 12,000 now, so it should only be a couple more days assuming we keep our luck similar. And yes, it is officially too late. So yeah, just three items left and everything that we got going on here. For some reason, nobody is offering on my watch. So I've been slowly dropping it. I'm not sure if it's bugged or what. I've had that watch since uh, last episode. So yeah, I can't sell it. Hopefully tomorrow we can because there's about still two grand there uh, in items. So still quite a bit. Anyways, back to bed we go. <gasps> I just realized there's people joining me. Welcome to the trailers or truck stop life, my friends. Can I just come in? You got a way better setup than me. That's for damn sure. I wish I could go in and... Look around. Hello. 
You do you not want to talk to me? Okay, this dude's looking at his fake watch. I guess it's time for me to leave. Nobody wants me around here. I'll go back to my, that my side of the truck stop where nobody else hangs out. Except for a shady black van that's probably freaking watching me. All right, thought we'd try our luck at the inside storage facility. See if we can get maybe luckier here. Uh, what is up with this? I'm not getting many options for lockers. Not that it really matters. They're all random, I'm assuming. I don't know why it tells you the occupation. They, they all seem so random. I thought like police lockers would have more guns in them and whatnot. Wow. We got the gamer locker, baby. Not one, but two PC cases. Both were 550 each. Nice. Oh, that's an airsoft gun. Okay, so this is a new thing too. There's actually like airsoft guns. I don't know if you can test these out or not, but it's so cool. You can open all these boxes and like inspect them. Ah, oh, Roomba. How much is the Roomba worth? Okay, 155. And then we got a blue truck. Yeah, this locker not so great so far besides those two PC cases. So, I mean, we'll make a bit of money, but not as much as I hoped for. Unless we find a Rolex in here. Oh, okay. Purses. Fancy. Oh, fancy purses. I saw 550 for one thing. Is that that little purse? The clutch, I think they're called? No, I guess it was this thing. I was like, damn it. I thought I had some good items there. I mean, they're not bad, though. Ooh, we got a nice statue. Is that worth a lot? 210. I'm waiting for that, like, major item. Unfortunately, uh, haven't found it yet. There's got to be some really high ticket items in here, though. Uh, aside from that, we just got a cheap little kid's chair. I may as well grab that. It's still $25. Okay, in the second locker. Of course, right at the friggin' back again, man. I feel like I get this locker the most. What's inside? A drift RC car. That's a bit better. And still... Oh! <gasps> Uh, wait, what? Closed car, gas, brake. Okay, so you can just drive it around. <laughs> you can test it. All right, well, <laughs> I wish I could follow it. Okay, I kind of can. This is so stupid, but cool. So it's an actual drift car. And I mean, I haven't compared to the other cars, but I can tell. You can see I'm sliding like crazy. I think it's like spec to actually drift, which is great. All right, I'm happy I was able to try it though, because that's just so cool to me. And this is a 110 skill. My other was a 112, so... This one's worth a little bit more, I'm assuming. The famous and the serious special edition. I should read these boxes more often. That's funny. Another 490. Always good to see that. Junky cables. Oh, this this locker saved me, man. This, so far, this is great. We still got a bunch of boxes open, too. What's behind this box? Another steering wheel. That's 500 bucks. Yeah, this is a fantastic locker. All right, honestly, these bins are so hard to get through the door. I may as well just open these up. It'd be way easier, I think. And there we go. Actually, not 980. Whoa! All right, so some of these cameras are actually really good. Okay, that's sad. This whole thing. Oh, I thought that was all closed. Never mind. Not sad. Not complaining anymore. That's two PlayStations in one. <laughs> I thought that was a bunch of clothes. So that's 370 and 550. Everything in this locker is so good. All right, let's end off with a rolly in this one, and then we got a little bit of everything. Okay, I'll take a, a bronze from Flamingo. Not as good as a rolly, but I, I appreciate that I have it because I haven't seen that yet. And actually some decent shoes. Okay, well, that's... Pff, man, that's a lot. There's got to be a lot of money here, so I'm very curious to see when we sell all this what we'll be looking like at the end of the day because we still have $10,000 in my bank. Yeah, okay, so I get it now. If it does come with a controller, you can use it. My little one, you can see the size difference this is a 122 scale so it doesn't even come with that so that's why i can drive this one around and not that one that's pretty funny actually what are you doing like i understand on cheap items but this is 250 dollars it's like me saying here take it for 500 how about yeah that's right get frig off I'm wasting my time man i swear to god if you do a zero dollars i might kill you okay then never mind sorry thank you for giving me what what i asked for well, had a rough time today. We're only at 13,000. Got a lot. Why is that question mark too? I'm getting a lot of question marks that I have to reset, which is kind of screwing up my selling process here. So yeah, we still got a few high ticket items. I maybe have 16,000 here. Yeah, we definitely didn't do as good as yesterday in terms of selling. So we'll get back to it tomorrow. I'll probably just buy two more lockers and add to the collection here because we're still going to need quite a bit to hit the 20,000 that I need. Okay, just because I like to test things, I bought the cheapest lockers I could find. I just want to see if this is totally random or not. It does look like you might get fewer items if you do go cheaper. Or at least there's less high ticket items on the ground here. So there's probably not going to be anything good today. Great. God, this locker is so bad. I don't even think we'll break even unless there's something amazing in here. 
Okay, 150. That's, I think, legit the best item we got was the $170 toolbox. Now we might... Oh, man, I don't know. Just looking at the prices, I think I pretty much maybe broke even. Oh, I forgot about this box. Hold on. It'll be a rolly in here. Ah, oh, not bad. See if the second one's a bit more lucky or not. Okay, two drift cars. That's a much better start already. Of course, I have to test if they work or not. I mean, I understand it tells me if they work or not, but this is great. <laughs> this is definitely drift spec, which is great to me. How far could I go? Oh, man, I... Oh, okay, that that, that far. Trash bass. Oh, base. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. We got a 490 and a mixer as well. Well, now I don't know if price matters or not. I feel like with price, you just get more items in a locker. That doesn't mean they're going to be better items, though. That was a really good box there. Okay, so this locker has definitely redeemed myself. And we are continuing with that. That's the second 490. Is this the locker of duplicates? This is weird. And let's get a rolly in this bag, please. Finding anything? Okay. Okay. Dude. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm going to buy cheap lockers from now on. $200 shoes? That's the most expensive shoes I've ever seen. What a locker, man. For $600, we made it like a freaking bandit. And the final box, is it going to end off with a bang? What the hell is that? Oh, I thought it was a giant USB stick. <laughs> it's two boxes. And we did end off with a bang. Not a rolly, but we got a $500 ring. Can't complain with that at all. Wow, that was fantastic. From an awful locker to a fantastic one. <gasps> yes, please buy that. Oh, I think that's my final big ticket item. 480. I'm so close. Oh, yeah. You know what? I'm definitely going to sell it to you, but I'm going to try and get a little bit of money off of you. Thank you very much. 19,692, and we just hit our limit. I was so close. I was running like a fine oiled machine, man. So, yeah, all I got is junk left, as you can see. But once again, only three items left. So, seems like that I'm at that perfect point where if I get two lockers, I can sell and buy it all in one day. So, we got to do it one more time. And assuming we get somewhat lucky, we got to be able... Oh, God. We got to be able to at least earn a few bucks in the lockers. So, uh, I think tomorrow we'll be the proud owner of a store. Well, first locker I might have broke even with. It was about $1,000. And by quick glance, I got about $1,000 out of it. So, that was the same as last time, though. And the second locker was amazing. And that means it's going to happen every time, right? It's going to be great when I open this up. That's not that great. But we do have a few things in here that get me excited. Oh, that's a bad RC car. Got a freaking broken table. Oh, my God. It just... You really don't want me to own a store, do you? God, even the PC is a piece of crap. A $100 PC? Ah, uh, well, there's my first decent item. Thank you. Okay, this is getting a bit better now. We have a play track four again. So we at least profited in this locker. Thank God. The hell is that? A speaker? You holding a speaker and a purse and a Bible. Great. That's, that's, this is not good. And a freaking x-ray. Who puts an x-ray in their purse? All right. My only saving grace is this box. I mean, we still should earn some money. Okay. Didn't expect that. That's exciting. Come on, please. Uh, that's not a good sign when it starts with games and a freaking target of all things. And an x-ray. What is up with x-rays in this game? I don't need any more freaking people's x-rays. Oh, thank God. The last thing. Oh, my God. That's... You couldn't have asked for a better ending on that. Oh, my God. We got... This one's worth more. This is a new one. Well, hey there, big guy. Hell yes. That is my savings race. Do not lose this. Because if we do, this is all probably a waste. Somebody wants my rolly. Please buy it. Please. Okay. That's an okay price. Uh, let's do $1,250. i will take $100 off. Yes. Oh, I'm only $1,000 away. Oh, I'm so close. And that officially puts us over the big 20000 I don't have a lot of money, though, and I do need to hire an employee, so we probably need to earn a little bit more than this. All right, and that is officially it. So I got $769 on top of the $20,000. i am a little nervous. There's not much money left here. And obviously, I need some money for, you know, stock. But I really want that store, man. I really need that store because I want to experience the auction house. Well, how convenient. Today is also auction day. What a day. <laughs> this is going to be good. I know I'm not going to have any money for the auction, though. But we can go sneak, take a sneak peek of it. Of course, after I buy my uh, store, which is an awful place for my store. It's on the other side of the map. 
but the other stores like double the price so uh yeah we're gonna have to start off small and work our way up i mean it's better than freaking truck stop that i've been dealing with all right and here is the beautiful thing wow this is really sad i hope i can like upgrade it i don't know i don't know how any of this works twenty thousand dollars i don't even really have enough for another locker but maybe i can sell this stuff never mind it's just trash <laughs> All right, so yeah, we have nothing in here. So I'm wondering if that's what the furniture store is for. I was always weirded out by the fact that you there's a big furniture store in this game. But you probably have to stock your store with that store as well. All right, I do have some computers here that I can use. I'm very curious. Okay, so I can hire workers. Obviously, I'm not going to do it right now. I just was curious of the price. And they do different things, clearly. So some repairs, some search. Uh, so we're going to need multiples, which is pretty cool. All right, but yeah, we're going to have to see how this store works. I uh, I thought I'd kind of hold my hand a bit. I'm assuming people will just come to my store, right? When I start selling stuff here. But I don't even know where to place it because I don't have any like placeables or anything. So I assume, again, we're going to have to go to the furniture store to buy placeables, maybe. All right, but let's waste no time. We're going to go to the auction house just to experience this. I mean, maybe I can get something for $790. I doubt it, though. Because this auction house is supposed to be like prime big ticket items. It's like a luxury auction house. It's not like, uh, I thought it would be like storage auctions. But no, it's a legit big auctions site where you can get some really expensive items. So we'll go experience it and maybe just window shop. Oh my god, this feels so legit. Look at this thing. Uh, oh, there might actually be an entry fee. There's cops here and everything. This is way over the top. Hi, super important guy who just bought a store here. Can I just go in? Yeah? Okay. Oh my god, how does this work? Oh, it is frick. Frick. All right, well, if I pay $6.99, I, I, I assume that we're going to be able to afford absolutely nothing. This is like legit an auction house, though, where you got a bid. I'm so excited for this. I'm not going to do it now. I'm sorry. We're just going to get a sneak peek of it just because I would never be able to bid on something with $100. And I'm not going to pay the entry fee if uh, I'm not going to be able to do it. All right, guys. Well, I hate to end off on a cliffhanger, but that was a big grind to get to the store. And I think this is getting more than long enough for right now. The next episode is going to be great, though. We got to get our employees. We got to set up our store. We got to earn a lot of money because next week I'm going to make it to that auction house, damn it. And we're going to hopefully buy something for probably a lot of money, but hopefully it gives me a lot of money as well. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Super excited to get into the store in the next one. And yeah, thanks so much for your continued support in this series, guys. Thanks for watching and liking. And I'll see you in the next one. Hey there. Before you go, I just wanted to let you know about my second channel, Gast. If you're missing my multiplayer shenanigans, then please consider checking it out. Scan the QR code or copy the link down below. Okay, bye. <laughs> It's too bizarre. Why am I bizarre? What's wrong? That face is too it's it's too messed. Here, put the smiler on. Somebody show him. Oh Here. my god. No, I'm keeping it.